Hi, I would like now to build a structure uh, to be used as a template for a transition state search as shown here in this small picture for a dl Salder kind of reaction using calcium. So we start with the builder with adding a few carbon atoms. One, two, three, four, and five. Now we have too many hydrogens, so we will remove them with this delete atom. So we can remove like this one, this one, this one, um, this, this, and this. Now we readjust a little bit the bonds using modify bond. So we said that this and this is a single bond. Okay. And then that this and this is a double bond. And this and this it's another double bond. Now we use a nice feature, Gaussian or clean, which will readjust a bit our structure. Ta -da -da. There we go. Here we see that we have already this carbon slightly out of the, the plane, the rest of the molecule, so we will add our dinophil under here. To do that, again, we go here, builder, carbon atoms, we put one carbon here, and oof, possibly, let's say, one carbon atom here. Again, we have too many hydrogens, so we use delete atom to delete this one and that one. Now, before adjusting a little bit this structure, we can try to do to move it a bit closer here. So we use modify bond, click this one and two atoms, and we can put it a little bit close. If we can see here both molecules are are moving and getting close to each other. Okay. Now we should move this one close here. But if we use the same way that, that we are done now, also this part will get too close. So what we can do is to trick Gauss view by removing this bond. Okay, so now it thinks that these are actually three molecules. So we can click on this, this, we keep fix the group of atom 1, while we translate atom 2, and uh, here we see that this gets closer. Let's say also uh, something like that. Okay, now we can inspect it a little bit. Starts to look pretty okay. So we can put back again this now as a double bond. There we go. And we use again clean. Now, fortunately, the, the molecule got a bit worse than what it was before. So possibly we will have to readjust again a bit the, the distances. So let's see again this. It's actually, it's, it's kind of okay. The distance between this and this, it's a bit too much. So get it closer, but now of course this is also getting too close. But maybe we can just say that we are happy with this this gas structure <coughs> and we can see then how to set up constraints to constrain to these 2.1 angstroms that were suggested as a possible good candidate for a template between these two atoms and these two. Now let's get a little bit closer. 
this and you can use select atoms and click here, here, here and here. So what we want to do is to put constraint between atoms 7 and 12 to 2.1 angstrom to be kept fixed during the entire optimization and the same between atoms 1 and 15. To do this we go here, Gaussian, edit, redundant coordinates. So we will add uh, constraint between bonds 7 and 12. We will freeze this coordinate to 2.1 angstrom. And the same for the other one, bond 1, 15, freeze, set, 2.1. Okay, now we can just prepare the input, calculate, Gaussian calculation setup. Type, optimization, and here we already have opt equal mod redundant, and mod redundant is the keyword to say that there is some extra uh, input, in this case the uh, constraints and we can choose whichever method we like and there we go we, just, we can maybe remove this connectivity because I mean now these double bonds are not really correct and anyway it's, it's too much and here you can see that it's going to use the modified redundant coordinates that we just set up then we just click retain File, save, and we save this file ready to be used.